guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another vlog. I'm so excited because today is the first episode of Falling for Fall of 2022. If you are new here, I post these videos every single fall of just fall related content to get you in that warm and cozy spirit. So you can consider today's video since it's the first one, the first fallen leaf of fall. I don't know, that's what comes to my mind. I'm really excited about it. But basically in today's video, I want it to sort of be a checklist of all of the fall home decor that you need for the season. These are gonna be fall home decor pieces that you can easily incorporate into your home just to feel a little bit more festive. I'm in my festive sweater, I'm ready to go. These products range from lower price points to more moderate, depending on where you are in your your decor collection process. I really did good picking out products. I'm really proud of myself. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, if you wanna see what home decor, what fall home decor pieces I recommend, as well as pieces that I'm gonna pick up for myself that will last for years to come, then please just keep on watching. So not only do I want my home decor to last a lifetime, I also want my fashion pieces and especially my shoes to last a long time as well, which brings me to today's sponsor, Vivia. You guys, if you have not heard of Vivia, I'm about to put you on. Vivia is a chic, stylish, sustainable, footwear brand that is eco-friendly and responsible, which that's all things that I'm really happy about. It's awesome because the shoes are machine washable, which means they are gonna last so long. So we can say, goodbye to fast fashion and hello to slow fashion. I absolutely love how comfortable the shoes are. I picked out a pair of heels and boots and you guys, they're so comfortable. I love the material that they're made out of. It's very flexible, comfortable, which is honestly perfect for fall, but really any time of year. You guys, are these not the cutest heels ever? I'm obsessed with them. They're so chic. I love them with this little sweater and legging combo. I think it's just so cute. Not only that, but their shoes can literally go with any outfit. They range from flats, mules, loafers, boots, heels. They have all different types of styles. And I think they just look super chic with either a skirt, leggings, jeans, you name it, it's gonna be so cute. And can we get into these boots? Like, oh my gosh, they're over the knee, they're black, they're that 3D knit material. They're so cute. I love it with the skirt and the long sleeve top. It's just such a cute look. The shoemaking technology is seriously awesome. They use a 3D knit and the best part is, is zero waste, which is super cool. I really can't get over the fact that because the material is made out of recycled materials and it's sustainable, it's easy to wash, you can literally throw them in the washing machine, which I think is amazing. It obviously makes them last a lot longer if you're able to easily clean them, which I love. So yeah, you guys, I will have my code for Vivia here on the screen. It's just Kara15, <laughs> that rhymed, and I will have the link in the description box to check them out. You can save 15% off with my code. You're gonna love them. Okay, you guys, so with all that being said, let's get into these fall home decor pieces that you need. So the first fall home decor piece that I think honestly everybody needs in their home are faux stems. You guys, I really think this makes a room come to life because it just warms up the space. This is honestly the easiest and probably like the most affordable way to get your house to feel like fall without really doing the most. I love sticking with warm, rich colors for fall, like burgundy or a burnt orange, but you can also go for more of like a beige tan color or even like a pale yellow, I think would be really, really pretty. These stems can easily be placed in vases that you already have around the house. And I honestly recommend putting a few stems in the main areas of your home. It just gives it that pop of fall and it just feels so cozy. Okay, so the second decor piece that I recommend are 
candles. So you could go about this a couple of different ways. You could get actual candle sticks in those more fall toned colors. I've seen them a lot online and I think they're super chic. Or you can get fall scented candles. You can get them from places like Bath and Body Works or Home Goods. Honestly, any home related store is gonna probably have candles and the fall scents just make your home like smell good and it just smells like fall. It smells like a crisp, like fall day, or you can get like vanilla scents. Absolutely love it. There are definitely some signature scents that whenever I burn them, it's officially fall in our house and it just feels so cozy. Okay, so the third decor piece that you have to, have to get is a cozy blanket. I highly recommend getting a material that's either knit, maybe Sherpa, maybe even fur if that's your vibe. Just something a little bit more cozy and thick that's gonna keep you warm in the cooler months. So not only is it functional, but it's also stylish as well. It just feels like winter's coming, like the cool crisp air is coming when you see like thicker knit blankets out. It's just a vibe, it's just very cozy. So again, you can get them in honestly like whatever color goes with your vibe, but I personally recommend getting like a deeper rich color. I actually have this throw blanket right here. I mean, I keep this year round, but I feel like this is the perfect example of really what I'm talking about. Okay, so the fourth decor piece really goes with those throw blankets and that is throw pillows, you guys. I saw a meme online that said throw pillows are a girl's updated modern stuffed animal and I just resonated with that. When I was little, I had a bunch of stuffed animals and now I have a bunch of throw pillows, but I really recommend, again, sticking with those knit fabrics, maybe fur, maybe even velour. I feel like a good like velvet pillow feels cozy as well. The the trick is really getting into those fall tones to really match with the candlesticks, to match with the stems, and it'll really make the room feel cohesive. Okay, and the fifth decor piece I've talked about before in my previous fall videos, and that is to switch out the pictures in your picture frame to family photos or sentimental photos that really represent fall for your family. So for example, if you have a family fall tradition of going apple picking every year, print off some of those pictures and switch them out in your frames that you already have. I feel like this is a really unique and fun way to celebrate the season, to look back on past fall seasons and memories that you've made as a family. And it's just really cute. And I feel like it's an upgraded version from having like a sign that says fall that you're gonna hang on your wall or you know something that's not going to be permanent but you wanna attach it to your wall. I feel like this is an easier way. Just switch out the pictures in your frame and it still gives you that fall feeling. Okay, decor piece number six is reefs. So reefs, in my opinion, are not just for the outside of your door. Like, of course I have my seasonal reefs that I put on the outside of my door, don't we all? But I also think it's fun to switch it up and hang reefs on the inside, on your interior. So for example, I love putting a reef on a large like statement mirror that we have in our dining room, even on the double doors to the playroom. I think it's really, really cute and fun. And you can also put it behind your front door so that when you're inside your house, you can still feel that festive fall feeling. Okay, decor piece number seven is definitely my favorite. It's the most obvious as well, and that is decorative objects. So that's your pumpkins, your acorns, just like your little objects that represent fall for you. I feel like this is a no brainer. I definitely go for more like wooden rattan pumpkins, even like a white cream ceramic pumpkin I think is really pretty, but obviously like get whatever fits your vibe. I just think those look so nice. You can even get like a deep burgundy, a deep burnt orange like I've talked about before. And you can place a couple pumpkins on different shelves, your mantle, your media console, your coffee table, in your kitchen even. Just like little areas, I think it's nice to just sprinkle in those decorative objects. Okay, and 
the final eighth decor piece. I don't know if this is necessarily a piece, but it is functional decor. So I feel like this is the perfect time of year to bring out your stand mixer, maybe get a cutting board in the shape of either like a leaf or a pumpkin. You can set up a coffee station, get out your fall mugs, just make the areas in your home. That was mainly the kitchen, but like you can apply this in different areas, just like fall a fi, I don't know if that's a word, fallify your home by making functional things just fall related. I think it's super cute and super cozy and I love that. I'm definitely gonna be on the lookout for a pumpkin shaped cutting board. I think that's so cute. And I always bring out my stand mixer. Okay, sorry guys, my battery died. I had to switch cameras. Anyway, like I was saying, there's nothing like a stand mixer out that just feels like fall because you know you're gonna be baking like something really good and especially having like a coffee station. You could have your brown sugar, your cinnamon. It just feels like fall, it's just such a vibe. So yeah, you guys, those are all of my decor pieces that I think, honestly, any home needs. Hopefully this gave you a ton of inspiration. Hopefully you can think of this video as like a checklist of, okay, these are the things that I wanna make sure I have in my home to give it that fall touch. If you found this video helpful, please make sure you subscribe. I'm gonna be posting a lot more fall content. Like I said, this was our first episode of Falling for Fall for the 2022 season, which is insane. You don't wanna miss it. Give this video a thumbs up. And yeah, you guys, with all of that being said, we, all of my fall home decor tips, we will see you all in the next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye guys.